Ho, 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 you bunch of hoes. Happy holidays, everybody, and welcome to the video. And today, we're gonna be going over my top 10 gift ideas for the photographer in your life, $50 and under. So without wasting any time, let's jump into it. Number one, and everybody's gonna hate me for saying this, but number one, a gift card. Now this might seem like a no brainer, but a gift card to us photographers is perfect because if we are looking at buying a new lens or something that's over $50, this will be a good gift that you can add to that purchase. Um, it's also something that we can spend on a lower gift, but it gives us the freedom as a freelancer to make our own choice on the gift that you give us. Number two is gonna be a card reader. Now, this card reader has been in my bag for the past four years. It's freaking easy, it's simple, it's straightforward, has a bunch of different like options to throw in the SD cards, so you're gonna be able to use it in the future. It's also great for people that are traveling or people that are on the go, because you can go ahead and close it like that. So it conceals really nicely, fits in a bag, um, super easy, super cheap, get this one. Now number three, as you might have guessed, are SD cards. Now, a photographer can never have too many SD cards in their bag. Especially if you're someone that shoots a lot of video like me, having extra SD cards, knowing that you're never gonna run out of space, is just such a nice peace of mind when you're out shooting. Now number four is a cleaning kit. Um, this is pretty straightforward. Just something you can throw in your bag or throw in your office that you can clean lenses. Um, you know, when I'm out shooting like moto or when I'm out hiking, my bag tends to collect a lot of dust and a lot of tree branches, whatever. And so having a cleaning kit is really nice to have on hand just so I can clean lenses or whatever it may be. Number five, a custom camera strap. Now this one is gonna be a little bit more personal to the person, which is awesome. Um, I would recommend going on to like Etsy or Amazon. Uh, you should be able to find some really cool custom straps on there. This is gonna be an awesome gift because it allows you to be a little more personal to the person that you are gifting to. Um, so you get anything from like a nice leather, classy looking strap um, to something fun, like say like a Star Wars or a certain theme. So definitely look on Etsy or Amazon for those. Number six is gonna be a UV filter. Um, UV filters are super clutch for all of your lenses just because it allows a piece of glass in front of your lens so that if rocks are coming at your camera or if you're hiking or if you drop your camera. You know, there's been times in the past where I've dropped the lens on the cement and the UV filter has saved it entirely. Typically the UV filter will break, but they're so easy to get off the lens and they just save it. So this is an awesome gift. If somebody has a, a bunch of lenses with no protection on them, this is the one you're gonna wanna get. So number seven is gonna be covered lens caps. If you're like me, I've lost every single lens cap to all of my lenses. Um, so covered is basically a rubber lens cap that you can put over your lenses. Um, they're super, super quality. Uh, you can throw them over all different lenses. Like it's not like a specific size. I think they have some holiday deals going on right now. So make sure to check out their website. Number eight is gonna be some type of multi-tool. One of my favorite brands is gonna be Gerber. They make a lot of awesome tools. Um, a multi-tool is just essential to have in your camera bag, um, just to be able to like tighten tripod plates or, um, anything honestly like there's been so many times where i've needed just a quick pocket knife to cut something and a multi-tool is really nice to have especially if you're traveling or on road trips it just always comes in handy now number nine is going to be a protection case for all of your sd cards i recently picked this one up super cheap and i cannot tell you how nice it is to have all of your cards in one place just consolidated and organized you basically just open it up you got your CF cards or your CFAST cards. You have those guys and then you can flip it over kind of like a wallet. And then in here, you put all your SD cards, your micro SD cards. And the best part about these is that they actually come with a bunch of stickers. So you can throw those on there to, um, you know, number each micro SD card so you're not losing track. And they also have these foam, let's see if you can see this. They also have these foam inserts that you can take out. So I could do all micro SD cards if I wanted. I could do all SD cards if I wanted. So lots of uh, options with this little guy. And I, yeah, like I said, I can't tell you how clutch this is to have in your bag or even just to have at your desk for organization. These guys are sick. 
And number 10 on the list is going to be Gobi Gorilla Tripods. Uh, real quick, it's Joby, not Gobi. It's a J. I don't know why I was saying G. I don't know why I was saying Gobi. Joby. Joby. Now, if you're on YouTube, you've probably heard of these. These are just a straight up kind of like a ball twist and bend type tripod. Um, so this one specifically actually holds the 1DX, which is about 11 pounds, but they do have one on their site right now. And I believe the cost is like $48, right on the edge there. Um, but these are super, super awesome because when you're traveling or when you're vlogging, um, they're just really easy to maneuver and stick to things. Um, you can hook them to a handrail, you can hook them to a branch. Um, and also like if you're out taking photos, like I've, there's been times where I've done star photography and I'll just have this guy, but I'll still be able to put him up on like a rock or my car and I'll still be able to get really kick-ass star photos. So the Gobi Joby. Gorilla Tripods, they're super clutch, super inexpensive, and everybody should have one of these in their gear vault. And that's my top 10 gift ideas for your photographer friend under $50. I was actually gonna throw in one more, which comes in at above $50, but it's in the kind of $70 to $60 range, and that is camera batteries. Now, no photographer will ever complain about getting more batteries. Um, similar to SD cards, you can just literally never have too many in your camera bag. They're always coming in handy. So batteries are an excellent idea if you are looking to spend a little bit more over $50. This is definitely something that your photographer friends will love. But I hope you guys got some type of value out of this video and I hope that you are able to find a gift for your photographer friend. And I know as a photographer, we are impossible to shop for. Um, everything is just so dang expensive always. So hopefully this is something that helps you shop for this holiday season. But if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to like, make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys on Wednesday.